you're Patrick Beverly right here, you got to start battling for real estate now, initiating contact now with Christian Wood. Because look at this, you're not doing anything, and look at Christian Wood. Now he's got you sealed in the paint. So now it's just a matter of, I mean, how easy can this be? You are trapping Luca here. Stop. This player's got to get way up here because you can't allow this pass to the roll man to get made. We're okay with this player two passes away. We are not okay with someone right here because there's a pointless trap if it's this easy to pass out of because now you've just given up numbers. God, Austin Reeves is standing and waiting to help. So you need to get up if you're Russell Westbrook and force Doncic into this help. Now this player can stunt, easily recover without moving his feet but you're going to get beat away from the help. Why? You have got to learn. Russell Westbrook's got to say he's in help, okay? And then you have to learn that you have a help defender. So you need to get up and force him into this help. What? Why would you sag off someone when you have a player re wait, waiting to double? Okay, the Lakers just clearly don't know how to trap. Right now, Dennis Schroeder has got to move way up here. You can't let this pass get made. When you're trapping, you are not worried about this player all the way here. You are worried about this player here. Because once they pass out of this trap, they have numbers. And also, well, this is also a massive mismatch. So, Okay, Luka Doncic picks up his dribble right here. Stop. So now all if you have to do if you're this Lakers player is get back out. Don't gamble. Why is LeBron James dropping into the paint here? Stop. You're fine right here because this is great because now I can get up and when Christian Wood comes this way, I can stunt and the dribble gets picked up out here outside the paint and then I can recover. Where's LeBron going? Look at now you're in the paint. So now look, Christian Wood's dribble doesn't get picked up until he's in the paint. All right, Luca right now is isolated in the post on Patrick Beverly, okay? So we have to double this. This goes without saying. This player's got to come over here. This player gets up the line because I want to kick out pass here. You go here. Then this player goes to the corner and you fall here, okay? But you don't double and yeah. Okay, so everyone's doing their job on this double team right now, okay? This player comes to double. This player comes up, all right? But LeBron has got to do it. So LeBron takes out the cutter right here, Dwight Powell. All right, but LeBron's got, okay, hold on a second. So now this pass is getting made out over here. If you are LeBron James, as this pass is getting made, you need to immediately be coming here. So Dennis Schroeder's here, and then the man that doubles comes here. But LeBron James is sticking around too long. Look at, pass is in mid, in mid area, hasn't left. Now he just starts to leave. It's too late. Dennis Schroeder can't get up on Christian Wood now. Cannot spectate here, so the defense collapses on this double team, okay? As soon as this ball gets kicked out right here, okay, we have a good rotation coming right now. Here's Patrick Beverly, but this player can't spectate, all right? This player is guarding here, here. You need to get back to your man. But look at that Lakers player, just standing in no man's land. Gotta rotate. If you are doubling at the rim here, then LeBron has got to help the helper, right? This player goes to help. You gotta help the helper. This is gonna be a layup. All right, if a skip pass gets made here, here rotation, here rotation, and then LeBron then moves on over here, okay? But, I mean, again, if you don't rotate the first time, this is just going to be a drop-off pass. Double the post. These rotations has to be crisp, okay? Rotate, rotate. But right now, on the air time of this first pass, this player should be going here, and this player should be immediately going there. But you're going to see that third rotation's taken way too long, Okay, Luca on Russell Westbrook one on one. This isolation, you got to clog up this isolation. You got to come here. This player's got to be here. So now I want to kick out pass. You're here. Okay, this player's up here. And then this LeBron moves to the corner, and the man that doubles takes LeBron's man. Uh, yeah, this is not going to end well on an island. Cannot be a spectator on these double teams. So you double at the rim, and this player rotates to LeBron's man like he's supposed to. But Dennis Schroeder is spectating. You have a rotation to make here if a skip pass is made here and then right here and then LeBron would come up to this last Dallas Mavericks player right there but Dennis Schroeder spectating and not rotating so Thomas Bryant's 0 for 2 here first of all you never guard past the three-point line away from the ball and your back can't be to the sideline it's got to be to the baseline so if you if you drop a even just a step and your back is totally to the baseline now we can get up stunt easy recovery but all three of those things don't happen. You cannot let Luca relax in the paint. Stop. So this kickout pass gets made. Right now, Austin Reeves has got to get up and battle for real estate with Luka Doncic. Initiate contact right now. 
There, you Look at this. You're just standing and watching. So now look where he's catching this. All right, so you're sending a double team right here. Russell Westbrook cannot be a spectator. This player's rotated down to take the man that's doublings, man. So on a skip pass here, Russell Westbrook rotates here. This player rotates here. The man that doubles comes up here. Okay, that's how it works. But Russell Westbrook is going to be spectating and not rotating. All right, so if you're Austin Reeves, you just got run off the line. Stop. Okay, so you cannot be just committing to a body just yet. You've got to stay up here. Okay, because if Luka comes this way and throws it this way, this player's got to rotate and you're the nearest one. So you've got to rotate there. And then this man comes up here. But you're, you're already committing. You have no ability now to rotate over here. So now this player's got to rotate to the secondary option, which he has no time to do, of course. But you did. Again, you want to force, you want to get up and your body should be this way. I have no help anywhere over here. But if I'm forcing Luka Doncic here, I have help right here. There's no place for him to go. But again, you're letting him go away from where that help is. What is Russell Westbrook doing? This player is the one in help right here. Okay, so you need to get to the corner. This player's dribble's picked up right now. So why are you still standing in the paint? Get out to the corner. This player did a great job being in help, but we don't need a triple. We have a currently we have a triple team going. That is not necessary. Very basic. You can't shot goes up. Don't spectate if you're Patrick Beverly. Get in and box Luka Doncic out. Look at Patrick Beverly spectating. So now Luka's easily going to get this offensive rebound, and it's an easy two. Hey, okay, if you are trapping Luka here, this player has to get up. Everybody one pass away has to be denied. We, we're not worried about this player. We are worried about this player, okay? Because if it's this easy to pass out of a trap, the trap is pointless. Now the Mavericks have numbers, and it's going to be an easy two. So the Lakers are just clueless on trapping. Maybe they can work on this in practice tomorrow, because this player's got to get up. One pass away. We are not worried about this player. But once this pass gets made here, you've given up numbers. And now this pass is a lot easier. Look at this. You don't take out the roll, man. So, I mean, what do you think is going to happen? Like, what a joke. Never giving Luka Doncic a two-on-one, and I'm never giving him the lane. Get up and get him out of the lane. Where's Christian Wood rolling to? The backside helps right here. Yet you want to give up a two-on-one. So how would you think that might end? What this is a horrific gamble by LeBron. Look at the, what are you doing? What what is that? I mean the Lakers just have to stop trapping until they actually understand how to do it. Okay, you got to get up here. All right, this pass cannot get made. There's no point in trapping if it's this easy to pass out of the trap. Look, now you've just given up a three on two. The, the, you your trap is point. Your traps are pointless. Can't switch a ball screen, certainly on Luka Doncic like this. you got to be level to the screener so you're ready to guard. You are not, and you are going to get toasted. Okay, so the Lakers screw everything up here, so we'll have to unwind everything. So right here, the ball's in Tim Hardaway's hands. You want to get here now, because if you don't want, as Tim Hardaway comes this way, you don't want to have to be having to move inward. You want to have to already be there. So now you can just stunt, help out, recover. Okay, that doesn't happen. The other thing. Well, hypothetically, if that was the case and that had happened, you're Russell Westbrook. You want to close out and force him into that help. You're 0 for 2, so you give up open jumpers. Okay, LeBron just simply cannot be here. You have to be level to your man. So you can stay in this same area, but it needs to be level to your man. I mean, you're not going to get back outward that way. LeBron's rotation here stops. So this player steps up to take the ball. This player's got to immediately be coming this way, and LeBron's got to come this way. Now Beverly goes here, and Russell Westbrook, who just got hit with a pump fake, comes here. Okay? Yeah. 